New fans for the Segway, I'm Paul Lin in New York. When it first came out in 2001, the Segway was criticized by some as being a $5,000 toy for technology aficionados. Now some dealers say sales are on the rise. We're here with Itzy Atkins. He is an instructor and an advocate for the Segway, and welcome. Great Segway. Why is it that the Segway has gained some new fans in this day and age? Well, I think it's the economy number one. I think that the, the oil dependency, the $5 a gallon gas is the main thing. But I think it's also the fact that we've, a couple years now, people have had a chance to look at it for its practical economic reasons and to re rethink uh, its, uh, its validity. Explain how easy this thing or how difficult it is to learn how to ride. Well, it's really easy. You just stand up on it and you're a little bit of movement forward and it will go forward, a little bit of movement backwards. It has plenty of redundancy so that it, it's, it's protected and it gives you balance. So all you have to do is trust it and use it wisely. It's um, legal on the sidewalks if you're using it for mobility. That's protected by law. Um, the police basically in the last three years have have enjoyed it, they use it themselves. If you're not in the streets and not uh, in with traffic and using it like a motor vehicle and you're using it like feet, um, they don't bother us. Spin all the way around. Now, you were on this thing not not 30 seconds. It's pretty late, Jack. What's it called? I don't even know what it's called. Paul, I got all the trust that you're gonna segue beautifully. Oh, Step boy. up with okay. your leg, you grab it, pull yourself up. With your mind, looking at my fingers, think, okay. I want to come forward. I want to come forward. I want to come forward. <laughs> it's working, it's working, it's working. Now, you go back to that position straight up and you're stopped. You want to go back? I think, but I'm going into a trance now. <laughs> what do you think? Now that you're that's not, that's not bad. I think I could get used to this. I'm Paul Lin in New York.